pulmonary emphysema is defined as permanent abnormal enlargement of air spaces distal to the terminal bronchioles with a destruction of the alveolar septi with a little or no fibrosis. Now let's compare this part of the pulmonary parenchyma which looks more or less normal with this emphysematous part. Here the alveolar spaces are much wider, distended, and they are associated with very thin alveolar septi. On the higher magnification we can see that some of the alveolar septi are not interconnected and uh, they end in the free space. Some of these septi are extremely thin and they are associated with loss of the capillaries. The smaller amount of uh, blood vessels in the pulmonary parenchyma then results in the pulmonary hypertension. In some places we can find anthracotic pigment, this is the, this uh, black pigment, and uh, mild fibrosis. However, fibrosis is typically not prominent. We can recognize a few subtypes of uh, emphysema. A centriacinar emphysema is typically associated with smoking and it is more prominent in the upper lobes. Panacinar emphysema is more prominent in the lower lobes and it could be associated with uh, alpha-1 antitrypsin deficiency, for example. If we compare emphysematous parenchyma with this normal unaffected part of the lungs, we can see that uh, alveoli are smaller, alveolar septi are wider, and they have more capillaries. Thanks for watching.